Hello and welcome to this week's episode of the Edges and Sledges Cricket Podcast. This is DJ and I'll be your host for this episode. And I am joined by an extremely, extremely special guest. I have with me Ritik Shaukeen of the Mumbai Indians and the Delhi team. Ritik is currently preparing for the IPL. By the time this episode releases, the IPL would have probably kicked off. He would have probably, um, uh, the Mumbai Indians would have already probably played a couple of games. So, Ritik, first of all, welcome to the show. Is this your first ever podcast? Yeah, yeah. first time. Thank you for inviting me. No, I'm I'm delighted that uh, the world is getting to meet Ritik Shokin through our podcast. We've got some very interesting questions lined up for you, and I'm told that uh, your manager hasn't uh, told no, you what the questions not yet. are. So this is going to I be, hope I'll be on my a, best a rapid behavior. fire. Now you're you, you seem like a, a a good boy, so I'm <laughs> sure it'll be it'll be fine. Uh, so Ritik, so let me put the background to this, right? So I'm I'm 38 years old. I grew up in the 90s. Uh, you're born in 2000, right? So we are almost a different generation. But you don't look like 38. But no, I look like 40. no, no, no. Way, that's, no. That's, a, that's a different story. <laughs> much younger. Story. Too much, too much gray hair. But see, when I was 15, there was so you were born when I was 15. But there was a movie that came out, yeah. right? Uh, in January 2000, called Kahona Pyar Hai. You were born in August 2000. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, <laughs> relation, yeah. <laughs> tell me, Ritik, you're not named after Ritik Roshan. Do you have six fingers or how many fingers no, do you no, have? No, no, five. Uh, one thumb, four fingers. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, well, one thumb, four fingers. So you're not named after Ritik Shoki. Ritik Shoki? Uh, no, no, after Ritik Roshan. No, no, but a uh, fact, my father's name is Rakesh. Hai. <laughs> तो फिर ऐसा लेकिन कोई What are the chances? ये आपको कितनी बार क्वेश्चन ये पूछा है लोगों ये मेरे को काफी जब से I've been playing IPL कम से कम पचास साठ बार पूछ चुके हैं कि इसका कनेक्शन कुछ कनेक्शन लेकिन कोई कनेक्शन है नहीं <laughs> So I'm disappointed our question is not not unique but hmm. okay so uh, of course no connection to कहो कहो ना प्यार नहीं 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 You will be the most famous Ritik going yeah, forward Yeah I hope so Right Okay, great. So tell us about those early years, uh, Ritik. Uh, who supported your cricket? Every time we speak to somebody who's an active cricketer, who's a retired cricketer, there's somebody who's supported their cricket growing up. And who are, who were your idols growing up? Uh, so when I was uh, like, I started playing cricket, my mom used to take me to academies and all. And then... My dad really supported me throughout my career. So I think my idol is my dad. Because he always took me to the morning. He took me to the morning at 4-5 o'clock. He took me to the ball. And he always took me to the ball. And you were always in the ball. And you were always in the ball. And you also used to take hmm. you to play cricket. In the ball. 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 सबसे हाईएस्ट बेकार टेम्परेचर होता है उसमें मेरे डैड मेरे साथ ही खड़े रहते थे तो आई थिंक ही इज माय आइडल एंड ही इज माय लाइक क्रिकेटिंग सपोर्टर फैंटास्टिक दैट्स दैट्स फैंटास्टिक इट्स ऑलवेज नाइस टू हियर ऑफ द ओरिजिन स्टोरी बिकॉज़ एवरीबॉडी सीज द द फेम एंड द आईपीएल एंड एंड द द ड्रामा बट यू डोंट सी द हार्ड वर्क दैट गोस ऑन बिहाइंड द सीन्स राइट सो सो टेल अस आल्सो you started life as a as a batter yeah. right so what changed your game because you're now an all-rounder more than a pure batter because you learned how to bowl what 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 how, how did that change come around because we hear so many stories of people being right-handed becoming left-handed we don't hear those many stories of of batters becoming bowlers i mean steve smith was a bowler who became a batter but uh, how did your change happen? What actually when I was playing uh, under fourteen, uh, like I joined a sonnet club, but there were so many batsmen. मेरे को chance ही नहीं मिलता था batting का. तो हमारे को मतलब जो तारिक सर ने कहा था, coach ने कहा था कि यहाँ यहाँ आएगा तो as a bowler आई हो, वरना यहाँ मत आई हो. क्योंकि तेरे हाथ से जो ball छूटती है मतलब the release you have is very unique. So you might be a good bowler, but I don't think कि बैटिंग में तेरा स्कोप है <laughs> तो मतलब बॉलिंग में मुझे कहा कि तू बॉलिंग में ही ध्यान दे ज्यादा तो मैंने जब से बॉलिंग में ही ज्यादा ध्यान दिया इंस्टेड ऑफ या दैट सीम्स लाइक अ प्रीटी टफ स्कूल 
that they say uh, your batting is scope nahi hai batting is pretty good yeah matlab sandeep sandeep ka bowler bowling kar abhi fir maine teen char saal bat ko haath bhi nahi uthaya ki bat batting kari nahi bilkul bhi pure teen char saal maine bowling hi bowling kari right and that that is obviously resulted in you then being picked up for an IPL team rithik na hmm. IPL was started in 2008 you would have been 8 years old when that when the show the cricket ka tyohar the biggest festival of sport started in india right how did it feel for you when first i want to just hear how it felt like being part of that auction okay, your name comes up on tv so how did that feel firstly where were you when the auction was happening when you got सारे की लिस्ट बना ली थी की इन इन में से लास्ट में नाम है मेरा अब पता नहीं क्या होगा तो फिर मैंने लास्ट में टिक जो जिसका नाम अनसोल्ड गया तो उसे क्रॉस और जिससे वो सोल्ड हो गया उसे टिक कर रहा था तो ऐसे करता गया करता गया फिर मेरा नाम आया तो फिर मैंने अपना पहले क्रॉस कर दिया कि यार चल कोई नहीं यार नेक्स्ट ईयर ट्राई करेंगे और मेहनत करेंगे लेकिन फिर नेक्स्ट टाइम सोल्ड मतलब आ गया कि मतलब मुंबई इंडियंस पिक नहीं तो उसके बाद आई गॉट really happy about it so i called my mom so my mom, mom started crying and all it was really good what a what a moment i mean it's it for a, a child that's grown up with the ipl as such a part of their life being picked in an ipl team and that also so i'm a delhi capitals fan rithik so one day i hope you come and play for us <laughs> okay are you So I grew up in Delhi. I'm a huge Delhi Capitals fan. We we've not won anything, but of course Mumbai Indians has won five times. So you've not been picked up by any franchise. You've been picked up by the five-time champion. Six times now, women's IPL, IPL too. Women, women's uh, WPL. Yeah, yeah, six yeah? times. They've uh, won. They won six <laughs> now. Were you watching the game yeah, on Sunday? Yeah, by the way, we were. We like whole team was and, there. And, another heartbreak for <laughs> oh, delhi capitals fans oh, sorry yeah. oh, sorry <laughs> delhi capitals <laughs> yeah so i mean theek hai our time will come our time will come anyway so so talking about that right so you've been picked up by the mumbai indians we hear a lot of stories of of uh, people walking into dressing rooms and being completely overawed by the legends that are there in this dressing and this is not an ordinary dressing room it has rohit sharma it has jaspreet bumra it has sachin tendulkar it has mahela jaywardhane it has i think john t roads is your fielding I, I, it's it just goes on the list is almost endless malinga i think does that does bowling coaching uh, for the mumbai indians so that, that that's that's like an all time world 11 in your in your dressing room what is it like walk, walk walking into that and being part of that dressing room See, to be honest, I already thought about it that कि मैं पहले बहुत नर्वस था कि मैंने कहा यार कैसे I'll deal with all that stuff. But uh, whenever uh, when I went to the dressing room, it was feeling like they welcomed me so well and it felt like home. To be honest, जब भी मैं मतलब उनसे बात करी ऐसा लगा ही नहीं कि they are such a big players and all. Uh, I felt like home. Right. interesting so we also seen the 2018 netflix documentary Mum- uh, about yeah. the mumbai indians cricket fever did you watch yeah, that yeah i did i did just just before going to the dressing room <laughs> <laughs> whole night i was just watching the documentary sure. but yeah, back to back what to do what not to do what's there to do <laughs> all these things awesome but i mean obviously like we can uh, dressing room stories stay in the dressing room i think probably best uh, for that but who's the who's the life of that dressing room tell us who 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 keeps everybody i think um, that there seem to be some pretty interesting characters in that dressing room so what what's it like being part of, are you are you very vocal are you are you are you very messy in the dressing room how, how do you uh, see yourself as part of that dressing room 
I think Ishan is the life of the dressing room because he likes uh, jokes with a lot of people and he's he has the best sense of humor. But me, I'm I am very messy, but I don't like to talk during match days. Like I keep to myself. I just okay. focus things, and otherwise I'm very chill kind of person. So, yeah, you seem pretty 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 chilled out. Uh, but when are we seeing the reels come out of you because obviously ishan is famous for his reels there was that reel in uh, in i think zimbabwe when they won that series the mundia to bach ke rahi uh, reels or, or the kala chashma yeah. reel that that they did so i'm looking forward to seeing you guys uh, <laughs> no, I, do a reel together so it must be similar one age, thing right? i can't do this rithik can do is dance yeah i can't i can't oh. dance only when there's a party and there's only boys then i can dance otherwise okay so this is this is a exclusive that rithik this yeah. rithik can't dance he can only dance down the yeah. track i can just make expression that's all okay. nothing else okay very cool very cool um also i wanted to talk to you about the coaching that you've gone obviously you talked about tarek sena sir at sonic sonnet club you're now being coached by the likes of sachin the likes of mahela the likes of malinga uh what is their attitude to coaching and how is their coaching developed you as a player is there any tips they've given you which have improved your game many times over for sachin i can imagine him also giving you tips on off spin bowling because he's into everything i'm sure i think uh, the main thing they give is confidence to the player that who is about to play because that's what the players need right if you can't change your game here or when you are in this stage so i think best cheez jo wo de sakte hain wo confidence hi hota hai player ko jo apni best ability ko show kar sakte sahi brilliant so rithik we are also we are called edges and sledges right so before we go into break i'm going to ask you a question obviously you like taking edges when you're a bowler but i do you sledge you seem like a very nice boy i have to say this you seem very calm very collected very got your head on your shoulders but do you sledge and if not have you been sledged because we love a good sledging story so tell us a story about sledging hmm. see I, i don't i don't like to sledge but i like i like banter in nets i don't sledge in matches to be honest i just keep everything calm and do my work and do my job and get lost <laughs> that's what as, that's as what you... my coach says do your work and get lost as you said you were, you go to an office but it's the vacay yeah, day yeah. so i i go to my office but, do my work and just come out <laughs> but is there is there somebody who has sledged you because you've played proper cricket you've played ranji cricket you've played now you're playing ipl you've played the sayed mushtaq ali trophy uh you you've just won the dy patel trophy so congratulations on that but somebody must have sledged you because i can't believe that you've come through the delhi circuit the you've gone through the ranji circuit some there must be some tension that someone has sledged you some at some point not i i don't want the abuse story because that's boring because abuse is just actually very boring anything clever witty something funny that somebody said to you while you were batting in a tense moment or when when you were they were chasing runs in the last over of a game or something something actually fun. when main jab bhi jata hu batting karne ya bowling karne main hi baat karta rehta hu dusre players se to wo kya mujhe sledge karenge main hi unse baat karta rehta hu aise so you're the instigator main hi hamesha unse mazak karta rehta hu to wo karna bhi chahte hai to kehte hai abhi yaar tu kya banda hai kya mere se wo karta rehta hai isliye it's other way around well played well played chalo okay so we'll go into a short break now and on the other side of the break we will ask rithik about the most talked about rule change in the ipl for many years which is the impact player because as we mentioned last week he was the first ever impact player used in india in the sadia mushtaq ali trophy so we'll don't go anywhere we'll uh, take a short break and we'll come straight back after that we're in conversation with rithik shokey 